Right then guys, we are back with another match day vlog as Staff of Rangers taken Warrington Town away. Today I'm going to be going to this game. It's my first time here at Warrington, so I'm looking forward to it. Only about an hour from where I am, so we an enjoyable away day out and it will be hopefully a good day out. So recently, last week, we came out a 4-1 four, four um, win at home to Grantham Town. That was a great win at home, finally winning at home again. So today will be a slightly different game as we have still got the best away record in the league, which we can take into this game. We're 8th or 9th in the league, I think, and they're 4th after winning against Baseford midweek 1-0. We have we've proved that we can win away at Warrington in, in 2019 in the 80s and 90s season. We won 3-2, and a few years back in the kit we won 2-1. We were two 0 up once, um, but it got cut and banned and because it was foggy. When we were struggling, we only lost 2-1. We were one 0 up, but we conceded in the um, last couple of minutes. So I think today will be slightly different as we're a much improved team now, and also Warrington a bit been up there for quite a few seasons now fighting for um going up um going up going up so i think the playoffs this season will stay the same personally we've got to win our final four games if we stand any chance getting in there even if we don't get get in there i'll be very proud of rangers season this year compared to where we have been over the last two seasons where you could say three we couldn't because of steve burr even though we had that good run and andy and alex um we we still weren't the best in that season. We were only good for half of the season after Jan after Christmas when they took over on the first, on the first of January on New Year's Day. So my prediction for this game is going to be I'm going in confident today um, due to our away record. So I'm going to say the Stafford are going to win two one today. I don't usually say a win away, but uh, but I am going to go confident today. I think it was a very equal game, to be honest. A tough game away at Warrington. But we proved this season against big clubs and top teams that so we can beat Matt Locker, we can beat Buxton, beat Bamber Bridge at the top. So it's proved we can. And we even get a draw away at Scarborough. So I'm hoping we can at least um, call away the point today or a win would be even better. So I'll see, I'll see you all at the ground, guys. See you all at the ground, guys, in a bit. Warrington Town, come on the Rangers. My prediction is 2 1 today for Stafford Rangers. Hopefully, we get the win. We've proven in the path we can win there before, but I think we'll do it today. We're still top for our way records. So, come on, come on, come on the Rangers. See you again.
Game in the way. Oh, shot. Oh, oh. Uh. Keep going. Corner. 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 Two nil. So unlucky. Yeah. Watch the back stick again. Oh, shit. That didn't quite work out, but I did it. Come on, mate, you just get stuck in. We started well for this now. We just invited them in. He's going to shoot. We just let. Offside, offside, offside. Go on, Trey, go on, Trey, go on, Trey. Trey Mendes. Oi! You can't give that one. You can't give that one. That was our defence. Our defence stopped. What? One nil Warrington. Four, de four, de four defending there. Hopefully we get back. We get back into this game. Oh bloody hell! Did he slide out of the goal paint or what? That's all right. On the right, come on, Kent. Yeah! Come on. He was actually fouled before that. That was a foul. He was fouled before that. That's all good play. Cayman's did the well there. Over Four nil now. Four. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I know who they're playing. Not <laughs> so I'm a Saints fan. Lee Simpson. Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. Unlucky, unlucky. Get it in the box. Oh, hey. Come on, Tony, come on! Oh, well done. Oh, That's a good idea. It's not to over! It's not to over! What a clearance! What a clearance! Half time. When you're on the goal line, Warrington Town, the ball on the second range. Come on, Rangers! Come on! Warrington, it's the one that's done away at Warrington. We were in poor. They've absolutely battered us over the pitch. We need, we're lucky to be one down. Hopefully, we go into second into the second half and 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 try to look look to play better as we're only one down, which is lucky. Come on, the Rangers. Soon, second half. The second half now. Warrington one, Stafford one, missed the goal as well. Alex Ray Harvey missed the goal. Score. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 What on Joe? Oh, 
Warrington Town won, Stafford Rangers won. We would love to we would love to win, but we would love to win, but um, I'll take a point now. A great point away at Warrington. Can you hear the road to say no? <laughs> Can you hear them? Right then lads, I'm just back from the back from the game as Stafford Rangers drew 1-1 against Warrington. Warrington in Warrington. I thought that and there wasn't really much in the game, really. Poor first half. We just weren't in it. We're lucky that we conceded one because that goal that came from poor defending. Our keeper, so he was Matthias who out um say made um two or three good saves. So so well, we could have been two or three down at half time, but the good thing if we're only one down and we can could come back and rebuild. And the goal we scored second half with five minutes into the second half, Alex Ray Harvey. I actually missed the goal because I just I was actually at the toilet at the time. But I when I when I came out, I heard I heard some some noise. It's actually that we had scored. I thought it, we, the goal went wide. I literally went and ce celebrated. It was kind of a late celebration, but it was still a celebration though. 
second half, we actually totally dominated them. Warrington didn't didn't want it, didn't do anything really. We could have won. We could have won it at the won it at the end. We had two two or three good chances, but overall, if you think about the both halves, Warrington were good first half. We were better second half. So really, a pretty fair result. But but it was us who had the final chance though. It's another point on the board. We we. It's a point on the board away at a team in the playoffs, but um, unfortunately, this se this season has been a really good what, really good one, probably the best season we've had um, have for quite for years probably in the NBL. We're even higher in the league when Kitch was here, but the only thing that's cost us this season is too many draws in games that we could have won. That is really what has cost us. So we are currently ninth in the league now. It's not um, it's not it's not bad. This is superior compared to the last two seasons. We needed to win. We needed to win today if we stood any chance of the playoffs, and we're now seven points off there. All we can do now is throw with pride on the last three games and win them all. I thought today about Warrington. They didn't look like a team that really wanted a push for the playoffs. I, personally, I don't think they will go up. Personally, but I think they'll still probably get in the playoffs. Um, so this was a brand new. This was a brand new ground for me. This was. Um, I thought. Um, it was an okay ground. It's pretty average. Um, the, there was no food there whatsoever. Just pot noodles and pies. How? It doesn't mean that everyone's gonna like that, do they? I don't want something like that. I want something nice and chips or a burger. Something traditional at a football ground. Well, they were selling pies and pot noodle, but as soon as they had all gone, that is poor from, that is poor from a club that are fourth in the league. Got to be by far one of the worst, um, uh, worst of food bars in the whole entire league. In the toilets, there's no soap, but overall, the one clubhouse was was good, right? Right, and the drinks were perfectly fine. I really did. I did enjoy my day here at Warrington. It was a new. It was a new. It was a brand new ground for me. So um, that's one I can tick. That's one I can tick off now. I'm pleased we got something out of today's game. It's better. It's better than losing like they always say. It, and it's a and it's a point. So I'll. So I'll see you all in the next one, guys. At home to at home to Bayford. That's a one o'clock kickoff for some weird reason due to the FA Cup. So final, the FA are defined it, and the club has agreed to it. Well, the club can't do a lot really against the FA, so that is going to be a nightmare for kickoff time. But anyway, I'll see you for that game against Bayford, and hopefully we can win it. See, see us, see us soon, guys. In a bit. Bye, everyone.